Good evening. A 32-year-old Perth mother is in hospital tonight after a terrifying home invasion ordeal that left her with serious gunshot wounds. Two men wearing balaclavas stormed into her northern suburbs home, first assaulting her, then shooting her twice in the ankle. The frantic few moments after a woman was shot by masked men. A getaway car races away. The victim's partner, who appears to be hiding, walks back towards his home, then runs to his neighbours for help. Uh, he was puffing and puffing, leaned over, uh, trying to get a breath, and um, he said, can you ring Triple O? I've had people break into my house. And he said, a carload of people come through uh, with baseball bats and guns. And I just, like, almost freaked out, thinking, Jesus... 32-year-old Amanda Sycamore was confronted in her Carabooda home by two men wearing balaclavas and armed with a gun and baseball bat. First, she was robbed, assaulted, then shot twice in the ankle. Her four children, including a nine-year-old, were inside the house. It's not clear if they saw their mother being attacked. Well, we've never had it in all the years. I've been here three generations and, um, uh, yeah, never heard of stuff like this. <laughs> Two men were arrested nearby in Tapping within hours of the late night home invasion. Police are waiting on ballistics reports to determine which firearm was used. A 22 and 35 year old man face court this morning, both charged with grievous bodily harm, wounding and burglary. They weren't given bail and will now have to spend at least another month behind bars before their next appearance in April. Amanda Sycamore is still in Royal Perth Hospital. Today she posted on her Facebook, nothing is weaker or smaller than the man who hurts women or children, whether by his actions or his words. Police say Amanda and her partner know the shooters. Alice Pooley, Nine News.